I don't agree and I don't accept that it's going to be an orderly three-year transition period, number one. Num number two, again I reiterate, why is it always the workers that are told that they're the ones should cop it in the neck? Can well, someone listen, explain I'll that tell you, to me? Well, I'll explain it to you, Phil, very, right. very happily, mate. Uh, you know, oncology, the study of cancer, shows that this uh, growth gets inside the human body. It feeds on the host, weakening the host. Eventually, the culture of the cancer completely takes over and kills the host, and that's what kills it's the, the benefit cancer. benefit of the doubt, that's but if you're calling workers a cancer, cancer, that is outrageous. The trade union okay? outrageous. is the cancer, and, no. I, and you stood, and your leadership oh. stood by when Toyota was begging for the chance to put a different deal to its workers. The, the, the AMWU stood over them and said, no, you cannot make that okay, offer to the so workers. Okay. And they no, sacrificed sorry, mate, their own enough. workers. It's okay they for the chief executive of Toyota to earn in excess of $1 million, but you're asking for the workers to take a $5,000 pay cut? Come on, mate. Fair go. They, That's ridiculous. And for you to for you to equate uh, workers with cancer is outrageous. I equate the AMWU with cancer. Absolutely, suggestion. they are a cancer. And the sooner we can move beyond, they, they, they're like well, they're you, like you the Japanese workers Benardi that were the found in the jungle in, America, in the nineteen seventies. I have just heard it all. I've heard it all. The AMWU is absolutely a cancer in the Australian workforce. Uh, no, you workforce. called the worker a cancer. No, no, no. Let's I, be clear about no, that. No, no, no. I, I, I describe the AMWU as a cancer and I do all not... Right, if right. you ask okay, me... OK, OK. I think we're getting a little off, uh, off track about what, uh, what a cancer is. The good news is that Ross Cameron and Phil Daladakis are both joining us for The Nation on Thursday night. Phil gave